expected with me. But it's okay. We're back in. We're just starting to get back up. Unless we've only missed like two minutes. Or something like that. So, it's, welcome back. 3v3. It's uh, Nabs again. Against an SY lineup this time, actually. Okay, we've got Life Chain, Rich again. And we've also got Paladin. But we're interested to play as we go. In the blue, we've got Wanda here playing on the flank as the Koreans. In the yellow, we're going to have Spain and playing as China Pocket. And on the flank, we're going to have Goths being played by Northern Pike in the teal. He'll be up against matching up against Paladin. Feng Zin playing as the Koreans. In the pocket, we're going to have Licks playing as the Goths. And on the flank, to finish it all off, we're going to have Love Chain playing as the Chinese. Sorry, let's uh break this down then, shall we? Any ball stealing shenanigans going on? Look it. All the boars look nice and safe. Although I am wondering where Pikes has gone. Oh, there's Pikes' boar. Looks like Paladin's on the job. He's gonna take it back to his TC. Yeah, he's, that's a that's a that's a secured boar. Boar's just like Pikes a little bit too far behind to try and stop this from happening. But there you go. I'll say there's no boar. Oh, Paladin! Oh, oh my God, Paladin! He's just toying with us, really. He's like, I'm gonna stop the stop it. Take a hit, just freestyle. Oh my, oh my god, did he bold? Oh my god, I, I don't have the multitasking skills to do that, to drop him in TC to fire and run around the ball. Woo! Look at you go. It will even find those two sheep too. Lucky bastard. But it looks like he will sit take the boar, take the second one as well whilst he's at it, and the third boar is where? Oh, he's already taken one, yeah, of course. He's actually going to take the yeah. It's going to give it a nice side. side. It's like Pike will take two sheep, though. Those are mine, he says. <laughs> he's going to try and stop this, but of course, you know, Pike having the full HP, well, pretty full HP scout. Ooh. Make sure those sheep are his and you'll bully away things. And so he will take 200 food, but you will lose a boar, by the way. So I'm going to chow as well. Interesting stuff. Oh, looks like Lake tossed the villager to a boar. That poor soul. Licks. A mass set of Oh, be careful, Wanda. Not the cleanest killer boars, but you'll be fine. You'll take it nonetheless. Alex, this is a, this should be an easy boar taking up with a build to this one. Put inside, it'd be absolutely fine. We'll just pause that. <laughs> Barracks been popped out by eight wonder. I thought he was going to go for a rush there, but I'm not too sure. No, it's too late for a rush. Could be a man at arms play? I don't really know, actually. What, what is the plan here? Well, the, oh, okay, it's going to be a rush. A little weird. I, I feel like Wanda's economy sort of like balances a little bit off. Like, it's got three villas here. Like, trying to get to a sheep that shouldn't really be on a sheep. He's, only got like two on berries. Okay, now he's into wood. I don't want to call it scrappy, but it feels a little bit out of order, that's all. Nonetheless, though, it, it'll, it looks like he's sorting it out and he'll be okay. But just a few seconds there where I was thinking, are oh, you doing it right, bud? I'll take those, gonna start warning up. Wait, look how many deer there are. Holy. That's a three pack of deer. Oh my god. If he was like Mongols, like. Jesus Christ, that would have been ridiculous. But he will secure at least those four, so five actually. It's a nice one there. I just saw it, I was like, wait, what? 
More and then more and then more. <sighs> he himself though, should have a Josh going and he's actually sending it across already. He's got a wolf in tow though. T90 will be on that right now, if he was here. Could he please just fight this one? Okay, no. Took a few hits, but it's okay. Couple of free hits going to get onto Wanda here, so might as well back off a little bit. Try and reach onto the high ground, but in fact, I think he's just going to wait for a uh, scout here from Spain to try and help him out. Now he looks to re, re engage here on top of the scout there, or Love Change. But it looks like a pretty easy fight coming out of here from Love Chain. Yeah, he's piling it right now into Wanda. He should be able to clean this up. Really solid job. Well played, Love Chain. We'll lose one in the back market there, but. You still got two alive, but don't chase the scout from Spain and... Oh, you're doing so well. <laughs> you were doing so well. Oh my god, this is like a merry-go-round. You know those, in those fairgrounds, you see the little pony going up and down, and you see the kids just chase it? That's what we just saw. You saw the little kid just, like, looking at the pony, or going up and down and just paying no attention. God damn it, Love Chain, you're doing so good, and then you cocked it up. Okay, but it's not the end of the world. It's got a scout that's practically one militia alive. So not a real amount of harm will be going towards Love Chang. Love Chang on the way up to the feudal age. He might do a little bit of warding towards his house here. But, you know, it should be okay. Spain got up to the feudal age already. Barracks up. Actually, that's a little bit late, that barracks. What are you on about? What am I on about? Blacksmith coming down. We should be seeing... I don't know, a stable? Somewhere. Wait, has he actually got enough spaden? Oh, spaden. You haven't got enough wood for a state. Oh, God. Okay. He's he's lacking a little bit of wood, but it's okay. You should get it up shortly, but it will delay his uptime, though, by a, by a small margin. You know, Lick's already in the field edge himself. He's already got the blacksmith in the stable on the way. Now, with this, though, it should come up. Relatively similar. To the 1 1 from Lich. So, fortunately, it's not the end of the world for him. Now, Love Chain. In the few like years, should be dropping for. Yeah, stable. Okay, stable blacks is coming out from Love Chain against the uh, Koreans from Wonder. Trying to deny the second server coming out from Licks. But really interesting choice here from Love Chain to go for a stable blacksmith here and not to go for an archery range. It's quite it's quite funny because if you, if you went for uh, this mirror though, because I was thinking maybe you'll go for it because of the mangonels potentially coming out from Wonder, but then that wouldn't make any sense. It's going to go for nice. It's going to put a little bit of pressure down on Wanda because, I mean, how do you deal with, like, two sets of... Well, technically, what's going to be a three stable knights, potentially. Well, it could be one. I mean, it could just allow Love Chain to go to stable blacksmith and then just, you know, basically tell Lix to go up top instead. So that's that's what he's probably doing. Probably it's definitely a lot better option, I think. Yeah, second stable. So we're expecting probably to see Lix to come up top here to support uh, Paladin. As he's gone for two range here and the blacksmith as well. As the drush there from Pike has got two wolves in tow, but um, a little bit of jaggy or wolf. Oh, he's actually got the nice range. Oh, like God, that's so close. One more. Oh wow, the wolf. <laughs> so the wolf, the wolf killed the militia. He's like, I'm on to you, villager. I'm on to you. Should be fine, but. That blacksmith will be delayed, and that would also technically delay the uptime as well for Paladin if he's, um... Anyway, close to it's not. It's 500 wood in the bank, by people. 500 wood. A lot. We will build a house there to sort that now. So the archer that they from Paladin only to build a bit of pressure onto Pike. But Pike's are pretty much not far away from, you know, being castle age. So 
So one's ever coming out from the Chinese pocket from Spain. So it's going to go for the second TC, just the third TC at the back. Yeah, right on top of that gold. So it's going to be a bit more of a greedy build, I feel. But with Pike also going FC in as well. And same here. And Wanda should provide him a good space to do so. Are they getting the wheelbarrows? XC got say, hey, come here. They'll be under a lot of pressure soon enough. <laughs> Here comes the two tables coming up. from Love Chain. Two knights are pumped out already. And we're seeing a TC being popped immediately onto town. Uh, sorry, to the gold, onto the TC. Town center popped onto the TC. Yeah, that makes sense. Uh, right next to the gold. And, and that should keep the gold safe. And again, with the wood at the back as well, it should be relatively safe now as well. So nice positioning there from Wonder. Now, of course, the front being walled up completely. Just got a guard the left hand side. And jobs are good, and right? Unless there's a gap in the wall. Unless there's a gap in the wall. And is, he, is it going? Ooh. Okay. The walls are solid. So he's going to have to try and find another way around. For now, though, love change. Getting a second TC up onto the wall line in the front. What comes out? Look at that. 250 over 250 Palisade, right? And it's not even built. What is that, man? That, what is that? Houdini magic going. Oh, there's a bird. Find the bird. All the pressure's coming right now down to five. Now the archer and the knight are breaking the house wall. Of crossbow pocket, plenty of crossbow coming out for the They should probably deter this away, I think. Even if they get in, it's a little bit difficult to try and press, press on. I don't think you know, Lickstone's got well, nothing up there. Right? They'll be forced away. And I would probably expect to see Pike just build another house right there. Pike's being a little bit confident. He's like, okay, oh, yeah, I've got the plus one crossbows. Let's go for a bit of a fight, maybe. He thinks better of it. Just like the knight, looks like the crossbows and a couple of spears get picked up there by the knight's hit and I love saying it. I love the rest of those crossbows as, as well, I believe. Not if you send a bit one by one, though. I mean, not the best idea. Oh, is it gonna die? Oh, five HP! It just lives. Or does it? No! One HP! Oh my god! That, that, that knife should have got down to the HP, but it did. But look at this other compound right now, just chopping up those candles like they're nothing. That looks like, uh... Looks like one is on the move here. Four spears are coming out for actually five spears coming forward here with a few crosses. Quite a big commitment to the spears here. That has to be said. Only because I mean like, you know, knights, you know, even if they get the plus one, they should do okay. Easy to move it around. Also, seeing those five spears out does leave probably your base a little bit open, but we are seeing a third TZ popped up onto the stone here on the left hand side of the house there. Probably might finish up the house here as well, just to basically seal off this entrance to the wood line, but Right now, I'm seeing an X mark right inside Spain's base. Probably just like, just like Lix is saying, hey, let's go. Let's bully the pocket a little bit. But right now, Spain's on 60 villagers, the most in the game. In fact, 9 ahead of Love Chang. Lix is not behind. He said, only 7 ahead of pocket. And anyway, two stables, but still. But the uh, Archer doing a really good focusing down those camels first. Now, it's time to focus onto the Knights here of Spade. No upgrades. Whereas Lix, yeah, neither upgrade on Lix either. But it's those archers really packing in the firepower right now onto this. Oh, that good yeah, that's like, he's going to be down. It looks like it's going to be still an even trade. Part of the reason as well is the fact that Alan was fighting it sort of down here. Using that full effect, but here comes Pike here up at the top here. Bokinara arrow now done as well. As the crossbow Bokinara arrow is coming in from out of the not soon enough, and will be picked off as they go back. Go on, finish the job. So, 
Monster being put up here by Spade and Bloodlines and Scale Barding Armor is also being done right now. But what about the other side that's going on right here? Love Chang doing his thing. Paladin. I think there's a TC up at the top here. Second TC, in fact. The third TC, though, I don't even see it being built anywhere. He actually got a university instead, and he's gonna get the ballistics done. Wait, but he's got another wood now after the third TC if he wishes. But he's kinda. I actually quite like this getting the ballistics nice and early for, what, 25 minutes in, but. That's gonna really help out in the fights against Pike. And of course, even again, yeah, nice as well. I mean, just generally the ballistics option is really nice to get if you can. Again, as well, as well, he is playing the Korean, so he wants to get that that eco going up soon enough because the Koreans are crap eco. <laughs> the last thing you want to be doing is puppy behind the Koreans on the economy. Can we get the 30 C up. Move to that gold. I'm seeing right here, right now, as well. That blood thing is again picking off these. He's not, uh, he's spearman. Nice. Well, he's got plus one, plus one with the bloodlines. So if those spearmen were just useless, and they're so gonna finish off the rest of those crossbows there from eight one. But one not. Not really able to get much done at this point. We get the pikemen now finally coming in. Barrett as well. It seems. But he's lost quite a lot of units. I mean, look at this: ten kills, to thirty-two deaths. And that's just the crossbows. That's Spearmen, that's everything, including villagers, I mean... No one else has got a terrible KD. Really, like, 11 to 6, 6 to 9, 10 to 32. Yeah. The one she's falling behind, she's spending a lot of resources, but not really getting a lot back from us yet. Now love looking at the plus 2 armor as well. But Spain though is doing a really nice job on the booming front. 84 villagers in comparison to 72 from Licks in, in the pocket perspective. I can uh, pile them quite similarly close. 58 to 58 is actually back. Crazy. I'm mean, guessing a fight is not smart right here right now, but this would be on the back end here. Pal is being chased back here by all these nice and Spain. And, and here comes Licks though with the plus one bloodlines. But this is a scrappy fight. But, you know, Right now for the SY team, because it seems to be out of position and they're gonna get caught out for this with their hands down, and that's what's gonna happen. Just gonna get a right old. Yeah, that was bad. That was just, yeah. He's gonna lose everything here, and it's a huge win for now. They eradicate this entire army from Lich and from Paladin. And the real fault that was there was probably Paladin, who went far too deep in between not just Spaden but also Pike as well. Like right here. I think he tried to pick a couple of bills off. But without the support from Lich, Lich was just too far away. And he went up here around his cliff face and then it just got really messy because Lix came with not enough units in actual fact. And they're playing with a defensive advantage. And dead. Uh, just got they just got obliterated really. And with that Thor, it could be a huge swing back. Like, you know, Spain and Pike could be like, what's press on it right now because they've got nothing else. Even sort of a TC foundation for two gold spots from Lix come up there, but that's not going to happen. We're trying to regroup right now, 10 and 20 in the first rate against 31 and 26. That is a tall order. I think Lix will pick up a relic though, that's my fan. Yeah, and those two balls are dead. One. No. They missed? Wow. Right, they're dead. And she's dead. But he'll be spared to tell the tale of how the other two died. That's what's gonna happen. Love tank up on the other side here, so I'm gonna get the support from Spaden to uh, fight the one of the support from Spaden. The fight now starts to be worse. Pike is up to the board here as well. The love coming out there from Love tank. If we get fucking down, two units here. I think the fight as well starts to come in from Wonder Woman. What force is back in now? A battering ram is gonna come out from 8th Wonder. Castle getting put up by Love tank just in the outskirts of the space in a nice little location. 
Every careful though that there's a few pipes might try and they can't deny it, but they're just gonna probably might kill a bit or two here just from opening up these doors. Now two battery rams are coming out in fact. And where's the seed workshop here from Love Chain? Oh, uh, I might have lost oh, it's over here, okay. Only because those bouncing rounds have got enough room to and take down this castle. So let's go a few hits. I hear the Imperial upgrades coming through right now. Spades is going up, Pike's going up, and so is Paladin. How did they manage to click up first on their team? Now Love Chain's looking up, we should be following up the licks soon enough. Amazingly though, the scores are really close, but SY are still ahead. I can't imagine it would be for that long though, because the equipment of the Imperial upgrades are coming through. We should be a bit of a swing around on the score front now. Looks like Pan's back in, now to pick up a couple of orders. And Lick's just in this though, nice and nice as a little fight. Not the best for Spade, he's got to... Yeah, he's got to hang back a little bit. And this castle coming at the top could get denied here, actually. I don't think he's enough support. There's a few knives, but the crossbow's doing the job. We're actually going to try and take the fight head on right now. Two monks going to try and do the work. This crossbow's going to work. This is going to be nice. Big fight, guys. I think it's going in favour of... Baden? Yeah, it's going to be Baden. It's going to be... It's not like a trap and don't say what's in the fourth level to buy. Both need to be upgraded, but that castle will go up now finally. The crossbows could pick up two of those roses. I might be just trying to stop those best camp, but he's sending a knight to the... I don't want to say it's their death, but... I feel like it will be. I feel like that, you know, these three upgrades could come in right now, and... Lick once more is not up to the Imperial Age. We saw it last game with the Garrison. I didn't know he did really well at that late Imperial, but... You know, it's 35 minutes, he hasn't picked up just yet. What's he like? He's got loads of resources. What? Okay. He should pick up now, I just heard. Yeah, I just heard the uh Seeds Rock spell, but God man. He either need 2k resources of both and he didn't pick up. Like, not the best, as we said. But Castle will be coming up here for him yeah. right now. Quite aggressive, it has to be said, as we've already started to see the house scars being produced here from Northern Pike as you see the conscription and everything else. I can just go for this, don't be nice. And also, anything he's fading here on the south side, this is going to be a denied castle. This is far too risky here for Lix to do, but he's going to go for it. He's going to try to warn his search as best he can. Oh, but there's a gap there between the houses. Oh my god, this guy. Oh, oh. It was looking good until the house broke. And there we go. 86%, 89, 90. Wow, you got it to 90, 97%. 97%. That's really got a key loss if you were like. Right. Alright, let's go on the other side of right now. Good news though, Love Chain is pushing in on Wanda, he's got the Chuko up in the front. I don't know if gonna try and convert this Chuko new, I think. Nope, they convert the Catalyst. Okay. No! Good bang and I'll shot. Just look at the splash down there somewhere. Next one flies in. I think there's lace waste of three Chuko new in a cat. Pretty good job there. Now the car's gonna get put up on the hill by Love Chain. And with Wanda already in Imperial Age, we'll be starting to see those trebuchets come out. How would they and Wanda have been done? And, ooh, that's not going to be fun for Wanda. Oh, not for Wanda, for uh, Love Chain. Meanwhile, though, spaden has got the Cavalier up and running. He's going to start pressing ahead towards Lix's base and not looking pretty. Lix can get the Halber Gear done, in fact. Things in, I think that's not gonna do much, but that castle though will be up And uh, that TC is doing the late. <laughs> Look at it drop. I'm just leaving the castle to stop at the TC fire. Yeah, castle gone. 
I've still actually pumped out here from like plenty of them as well. And it's taking care of, of the Alpha Gaze that have some licks and. I just heard. Bombard cannons? I just heard Bombard cannons, am I right? Is it from. Oh, yeah, there it is. Things in good. Yeah. Up and running because of the hand cannoneer combination with the Arbalest as well. We're going to send it down to Southwood because Pike is on the move right to the base of Pike. Did he just drop the relic out? He dropped the relic out to save one. Oh, the three. That is cute. That is cute. Who's going to put it in? Oh, he's going to put it in. He's going to save it, but there you go. Right now on the list, we're just gonna go all in on it now. Yeah. Traveling, trying to get a little up. What can we do? I haven't got the economy really anymore to just reduce how it is. We're just losing as fast as it's creating. On top of that, we should do as well. So I'd love to take the other side. Just take that one with the light down. It's not a lot else you can do. Well, it's not a lot else you can do. Is just coming through right now. It's like Fangs is going to try and get down there and help his teammate out, but been a little bit cut short out. Of the and Lix is dead. Lix is just wiped out. 110 pop, 101 pop in total. Zero moves at 9, 10. Really means nothing to him at this stage. Look at the elite hush job done. And the Misses the attack of Craig, but that's it. But it's numbers. <laughs> On the other side, so though, you still think it's okay, it's actually something that Pascal's can slide here. It's actually relatively okay ish against Alvarez and the Oranges, but the problem is, of course, is that those Oranges in that big mass, one good shot, and that could just eradicate most of them, so. No, because it's not my child, that's what's possible. Chain. That's a really nice option. No TC's left, but he has nine villages. He has to run. He's just actually going to go to the lump. Where's he going? Are they running away? It looks like they are. They will get away with those two villages. But holy cow, he just got this. Boy. This is definitely going to be now it's a 3v2 and the cover is three and two full like late game mode. But all the tools put this on. So now we're gonna have this sort of split issue here between uh and uh watching here, which in terms of where is Spade and like going to try and take Paladin on or well it looks like Paladin's gonna try and start forcing the issue back at Pike's base who's got a couple of bombard players. The villagers are repairing it nice, nicely. Oh, game sounds a bit too high. Okay. There we go. Thank you. I've got it. Thank you for letting me know. I'll uh, sort it out as that game is. <laughs> Classic. But the game is now ended. GG has been called by the SY team, and that was just well, well played. Just has to be well played by the Nav team. I mean, like it, it was just it was kind of weird. Like one big moment, the biggest moment probably in that game was when Paladin and uh, Lix were having this sort of awkward fight. It wasn't even an awkward fight. It was just like a slaughterhouse situation. Just. Paladin got caught out in between two bases and then Lix came in charging in and was just like, okay, let's fight. And then 
then it just ended because like it, bad positioning, bad call. It was just a bad call that game really. And then from then on in as well, Nabs Spain had a really nice economy going ahead of Licks, and it just dominated the game from there. Pike and uh, Pike and uh, Spain did a really nice dual, dual combo. Just they just shut down Paladin, not Paladin. God, uh, they shut down Licks super hard, super hard. You can lower it a lot more. Okay, I'll lower it a lot more. All right, okay, it should be better now. It should be better. Yes. Oh, I didn't look at the stats. Sorry. Yeah, sorry. I got, I got a, I got a, a newish, newer setup going. So I forgot to lower the sound. I, I installed a new SSD and I got a new monitor and stuff. So or an extra monitor. So I cloned, I cloned my hard drive over and stuff and. And with that, I had to re reinstall Vubly and whatever, because it was, I don't know, it was just me being me, so I uninstalled it, reinstalled it, and then uh, all that shenanigans. Should be fine now, yeah. I think I've got enough time to do another one. Uh, if they start, yeah, I might do another one, and then I'll have to go, because I'm actually getting really hungry.